travel. How many years have you been doing this? Uh, like 15 years. Damn. Um, I'm going to get into this one day. Yeah, there's an instructor right there, that guy with that one jacket. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, taking people tandem right now. Okay. And uh, they're just waiting for it to be a little better. I don't have very much time. How long are you all here for today? I only have another half hour and i got to go, but these guys will be here all evening. Very cool. I'm going to do this up. Right by you guys. But man, no good. Go back over there. But I think I'm gonna. These guys. I bet in a little bit if it gets better. Like we're we're hoping this. If the sun comes out, it adds thermic energy. Oh really? And um, yeah, so that's where we we can go up if there's warm air. Okay. So we're, we're kind of solar powered. That's pretty cool. So yeah, if there's sun and we can get some thermals, the, the wind's the right direction, it's just not quite strong enough. And um, everyone was flying for a couple hours earlier gotcha. on our other site. Now we're at an old gold mine. This is deep in the mountains. There's a gold mine in the 1800s. A lot of it's still standing. You can see the bunkhouse. <coughs> Waterfall. These are all original buildings down there. The life of a prospector. In these mountains. Look at those Lord of the Rings style mountains. So here we're at the top of the little hill we climbed overlooking the gold mine. Look at this little baby train, it's so cute. I feel like I'm in a Wild West like movie, movie set. This was the train they used to move the gold and the wastes, you know, the rocks and all the stuff. Just move it. It goes throughout the town. You can see like there. It's a little trolley system that goes around. So I'm guessing they just send it back and forth. Look at all the old wood and nails. An old building. Old sheets of metal. You can see the grooves for the, the train tracks. Pretty neat. Little kid riding his bike. Hmm. You can see all the water. Where they got their water from. It goes, uh, uh, it goes into the tunnel. So cool, I feel like I'm on a movie set. Like going back in time. Yep, as I suspected, the train would haul waste and rocks and ore to the mill. <clears throat> Very cool. You can see where the train tracks intersect. Right at the base of that rock. See that? And that's where the train used to go. Cross that bridge there. You know, it would loop around, but it's destroyed now. Oh, I'm sure it would have been cool to see back in the day. It's been a full day, it's a half day. And of course, the weather is the nicest it's ever been. Look how pretty the sky is. Anyway, um, it's a. We're currently at Ranger Muskox Farm. I don't know if this is close to where we were staying, so. 
I didn't really need to go any place far. I didn't need to go very far to visit. So it's a nice little final activity here. I have a bit of a cold. That weather is gorgeous. Of course, the day really. That's cool. Oh, So expensive. They have some really nice scarves and things, but just a little too pricey. Really nice though. Skeleton. Look at this pelt. This is a mean pelt. They're not that big. Short mm -hmm. one of them size, but they are very flexible, so they'll bend down. So if you see one Tarzan, you're still just going to want to step back and look on. I've never seen that happen. Come in to say hello. Come so cute. Oh, my gosh. What a handsome boy. Female, pretty well based on their horns. Uh, the top of the horn is called the horn boss, and the males have developed to have really thick ones. It acts like a helmet for them. So when they butt. Exactly. Yeah. Somebody wants to hold this. It's about 40 pounds. It's a bit heavy, but it's kind of cool. Yeah. How many people can say they've held a muskox? <laughs> Three-legged muskox. She lost a leg when another ox chief shot her. Rammed her in the leg, shattered her leg. That's one of their toys. They just push around for fun. Bones really aren't that big. I mean. Bones, well, I mean, at least this one is really small. It's like a little bit larger than like a really large dog, you know. In terms of bones, of course, they weigh a lot more. <laughs> 